Welcome to another Photoshop tutorial from tutorvid.com. This tutorial is going to go over blending faces from one image into another image. One problem with group portraits is you'll have some people with nice smiles in one image and other people with nice smiles in the other image. So this tutorial will show you how to merge parts of two images into one. So I'm going to use Bridge to open both of these photos up as layers in one image. Control click both of the images and then go up to Tools, Photoshop and select Load Files into Photoshop Layers. Photoshop will open the two files into one image and stack them up as two layers. So your first problem is getting the images lined up. Photoshop has a cool new feature that automatically aligns two layers. I'll control click both of the layers and then go up to Edit Auto Align Layers. Keep it on Auto and click OK. And then you can see that Photoshop did a pretty good job of matching these two layers up. Sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. So if not, you'll have to align them manually. And now there's a bit of space around the outside of the image that is extra. I'll crop that out with the Crop tool. Now the next step is to determine which layer you're going to use as your base layer. I'll just stick with the one that's on the bottom for now. So what I want from this top layer is the eyes of this guy here. So I'll select the selection tool and select that area of the image and press Control J. And now you see I have another layer on the top. If I hide these other two bottom layers, you can see that it's just the eyes of that guy there. I'll rename that layer to right guy and I'll also take the head of that top girl, so I'll select that and make sure you have the correct layer selected where you're going to be copying from. Control J again and rename this layer to top girl and then maybe I'll take the bottom guy as well. Now I'm done with this layer so I'll just drag to the garbage bin. Now to blend these faces into my base layer, I'll rename this as base layer, I'm going to have to use a layer mask. That's done by pressing this button here. So with the right guy layer selected, I'll select my layer mask, which is this icon here that comes up, and then using the brush and make sure you have a soft brush, hardness as 0%, and black as your foreground color. I'm just going to paint on the layer mask. If you're not sure how layer masks work, check out a tutorial on those. So I'm hiding part of this layer, merging layer, and if you do it well, it should be impossible to tell that you have merged two layers. Going on to the top girl, add the layer mask again, and then hide away part of the layer that I don't need. If you make a mistake and hide away parts that you should have, you can press the X key to flip the black and white and then paint again to bring back the layer. That one looks good there. And the bottom guy. If you need to move these layers around at all, you can press the move key and then you can grab and move them around as you want. To make sure they're aligned in the right spot, you can change the opacity to 50% so it becomes slightly see-through and you can align them in approximately the right spot and then bring the opacity back up to 100%. So his layer mask, brushing around the outside to make a soft transition. If we look at the before and after, there's the after and the before and the after again. And that's it. Check out more tutorials on tutorvid.com. <laughs>